Hello folks and welcome to Pokemon Go. Guys, we got an exciting news. Some very, very exciting news that some people will like and some people will not like. So please follow along and I'll make sure that I will be posting this video by today and you guys will be excited for this. But trainers, Professor Willow's global research challenge ends with a power packed ultra bonus event. So here's the picture with Mewtwo and his, wow, I just love the effects of this, the global ball and we got the birds back. So trainers, throughout the past few months, many of you have worked hard to meet the goals of Professor Willow's, Professor Willow's global research challenge during the Dormoot Safari Zone event in June, Pokemon Go Fest July and the Yokosuka Safari Zone event in August. Trainers from around the world completed a variety of research tasks for Professor Willow with dedication and enthusiasm. And now it's time to celebrate with a special ultra bonus event. First starting September 13th at 1 p.m. PST. Trainers from all over the world be, will be able to encounter three legendary Pokemon originally discovered in the Kanto region. Articuno, Zapdos, and Moltres will appear in raid battles until September 20th, and if you're lucky, you may be able to encounter their shiny forms. So going back to this is very good and they're going to bring all the shiny forms back the legendary for the legendary birds and this is for people that don't have shiny Articuno, shiny Zapdos and shiny Moltres. So for me, I am going to catch shiny Articuno as my focus because I didn't get shiny Articuno back then. So they're going to lay out shinies for those legendary birds, but my focus is going to be shiny Articuno. So yes, but I'm also going to do Zapdos and Moltres to get their shiny forms. See if we can get better IVs for them. So that's going to be awesome. And also Pokemon originally discovered in the Kanto region will appear more frequently all over the world and show up more frequently in raid battles until September 30th. And there's more trainers, there's more. On September 20th at 1 p.m. PDT, Mewtwo will come to raid battles. About time. We were thinking, when will Mewtwo be in raid battles? And they're finally up. But here's the thing with raid battles. Mewtwo being in the raids, even though Mewtwo's going to be there more, it kind of ruins the rarity, and I understand that for some people who say, hey, I think Mewtwo should have been the rarest one for raids. If they're going to come and go as much, just like other legendaries, then the way that Niantic even built it, like Mewtwo will be around the whole time. They have to go through EX raids, and that's not fun. It's hard for people that couldn't get their Mewtwo during that whole year. Even for me, I had this struggle of getting Mewtwo for six months. So yes, there are times and troubles that happened before, but hopefully you guys will be excited for Mewtwo because I'm thinking like, hey, let's get Mewtwo into raids. Let's see if we can get 98% or 100% IV Mewtwo. That's probably the goals that I'm gonna go through. So Mewtwo will come to raid battles for the first time. Mewtwo has previously only been available to trainers invited to the EX raids, but now trainers will be able to challenge this legendary psychic type Pokemon until October 23rd. Wow, that's a whole month. That's sick. At 1 p.m. PDT. So prepare yourself and don't miss the opportunity to encounter this powerful Pokemon before it disappears. I wanted to cover this a little more because the Ultra Unlock is supposed to be insane. So I wish Mewtwo would have been introduced as a shiny 
for a whole month, I think that would have been awesome. Because, I mean, getting Mewtwo back and forth with dedicators that got Mewtwo, like, let's say 16 or 20 times. I would say 16 times Mewtwo, you know, people will feel bored to get another Mewtwo during this event. So, I just feel like they need to implement its shiny form because, you know, since the birds became a shiny form, like, let's have Mewtwo as a shiny. You know? And I think it's good for the Ultra Unlock bonus. Like, it should have been Shiny Mewtwo. Like, exactly. Introduced for a month. So, back to this. Finally, there is one more special surprise. Farfetch, Kangaskhan, Mr. Mime, and Tauros will be joining the Alolan Pokemon in 7km eggs through the end of September. So, these Pokemon have not migrated on many parts of the world. So don't miss the unique opportunity to send gifts to friends and finally achieve a complete Kanto Pokedex. So for everybody that hasn't really been into places part of the world to try to get Mr. Mime, Kangaskhan, Farfetch'd, and Tauros, be ready for that. Because I, I understand you guys got it from trades and that's okay. But I think for all this, it's good to have more regional exclusives from Kanto. So make sure you get those. So, okay. And then the last paragraph says, Thank you trainers for working together to complete Professor Rello's research. There is plenty more to explore and many new Pokemon to discover. So let's get out there and go. So yeah, I think this whole turnaround is very exciting. But with that said, I think many people would rather have Shiny Mewtwo as the event because if they're going to introduce Shiny Mewtwo, probably just be like one of the birds that were introduced as its shiny form. It's got to be the same way because it's all shinies. It's all shinies. And, you know, Mewtwo... If it's supposed to be on ultra unlock for the to activate the raids for a month, let's get shiny Mewtwo in there so that most people will get a chance to get shiny Mewtwo. That will be the fun part of this ultra unlock. So yeah, guys, that's about it. And I hope you enjoy this video. L let me know in the comments, like, let's hear about your opinion about the ultra unlock and why you think you don't like it or you like it you know we need to hear feedback from you guys like i gave you guys feedback about a monthly mewtwo raid to become a shiny so let's hear about your opinions from the community about what the ultra unlock should have been by the way we're probably gonna have a new ex raid boss now i don't want to speculate anything but we're gonna keep it as a surprise so yes guys and I hope you enjoy this update and be ready for September 13th for the birds and then September 20th for Mewtwo. Thank you all for watching.